Hello world, my name is Pin Valentine and welcome back to Pinland. And today, oh look at me get real close there, ready? Ready? Oh, that's really close, too close. All right. Uh, today we are in Pinland and starting right next to the llamas here because we are going to try and spruce this up a bit. Let me first tr throw on my armor just in case. You never know with these things. Now what I need to know first, and well, yes, we are going to uh, spruce up the llama enclosure, but what I need to know first is if I have one of these tied to a lead. Obviously they all follow, but... The question then is, come on guys, come on, come on, come on, everybody follow me, come on, Mr. White, let's go, you have been causing me nothing but pain, let's go, if I have one of these guys tied to a lead, will they all stay with him, which is the big question of the day, if they do, then no problem. And it looks like they will. So first thing I'm going to do, I have this idea where I'm going to build up the walls with dirt and, um, what are they, uh, uh, dark oak trees. And make it look a little natural, but at the same time I'm kind of kind of going to try and do it in the same sort of fashion as, move, hopper, out of my way, as what you would see in a zoo. Not that you guys are on exhibit or anything, because you guys are so much better than that. So I'm going to do that. I'm going to have to get rid of you, I'm sure. There we go. Let's bone wheel this. And just like that. So that's going to be the corners of the ex ex enclosure. So far, it looks like they're all staying in place, which is great. All right, so let's do that on all four corners real quick so I can get that out of the way. I'm going to have to get rid of you. I have shovels in my inventory. Don't worry. I'm just trying to get as much done as I can because and, and well and because I don't want to go into my inventory so I got to get rid of you two as well I'm pretty sure they need a space next to them let's see will you grow there we go so that's two corners done next corner and down you go let's just get rid of all of this just in case I need all the room that I can get and let's go ahead and grab a shovel might as well might as well sort of make this go as quickly as possible because I don't want anything to happen where my llamas get hurt or they run away no you don't go there but you do go you go here I think that's fine if there's a hole there yeah alright so that's three corners I'm gonna have to get rid of that tree but that's okay for now. And last corner. There we go. And there we go. Four corners done. So I don't need the saplings or the bone meal anymore. But what I do need now is my dirt. I'm going to push you up too. So, I'm not entirely sure how I'm going to do this. But I'm, uh, I'm going to try. But first, let's take down all of these fences. Okay, so first step after tearing down all the fences was to build these dirt walls at least too high. And I made it even all around so that when they are released, they can't escape. Now, what I have to do is some terraforming. And I don't think I have enough dirt for this. But I'm going to do what I can to make this look somewhat natural. But I'm not going to cut away quite yet. Uh, I need some help from you guys. And the reason why I need some help is because some things are happening that I was not anywhere near to expecting. What I mean is that just over a week ago, uh, as of recording this a week ago yesterday, I hit my first 50 subscribers. Okay? That took five weeks to get there. And again, I, it really doesn't matter to me how long it takes to get to any milestone because it, for me, it's all about having the fun. Right? Can we make this look natural? 
Now, however, the problem is now that I am, as of recording this video, at exactly 80 subscribers. Just a week later, I hit 80 subscribers this morning. And which means I am right around the corner from hitting uh, 100 subscribers. I could be, if the momentum keeps up, I could be hitting 100 subscribers in a week. It kind of all depends. And the thing is, for 50 subscribers, I got an idea, I performed the idea, I like the idea. But now I, I kind of have no idea what to do for 100. Um, and I wasn't expecting to hit 100 until the end of February. And it looks like it's going to be happening much sooner than that. So I've been stressing out a little bit about... Uh, I don't know, I just feel like uh, I might not be producing enough content to keep 100 subscribers happy. That's part of it. Uh, part of it is... I'm going to leave this bear for now. I'm going to leave the bear up here for now. I'm just going to work on the sides. And, um, yeah, part of it's about not being able... I, I don't know if I can keep 100 subscribers happy, but most importantly, I have no idea what to do for 100. That's completely foreign to me. You need to go away. And... Mm, I, I kind of... I don't know what to do. So leave your suggestions in the comments. Uh, Cyrus, who's a subscriber and a friend of mine, has given me a couple of ideas. Some of them I really like, and I might do one of them. But um, I need more dirt, too. But other than that, I don't know. Tell me what you guys want to see. What are your, some of your guys' ideas for 100 subscribers? Because I have no clue. But in the meantime, while you guys are mulling that over, I'm going to go grab some dirt. And I'm going to do some more terraforming. Oh, that's all the dirt I have? That can't be all the dirt I have. No. Yeah, I have a lot more dirt. Look at that. Okay. Anyway, you guys mull that over. Tell me what you guys want to see in the comments. Don't be afraid. I'd be happy to hear them. And I'm going to do some more terraforming. I'll see you guys in just a moment. Okay, so I've done some terraforming. Terraforming? I've done some terraforming. Now, my biggest issue now, of course, is that they can climb up and get out. I don't know why they would want to. I'm going to get a bucket real quick. I don't know why they would want to. It's such a lovely place for them. What I might do is I might change some of the area to stone because I think llamas like mountainy type areas. What was I going to get rid of? I was going to get rid of this door here. This door. And these fences for now. There we go. I'm going to get a bucket. And I'm going to place like a little waterfall. A simple little waterfall. There we go. There we go. And I know it's still quite early in the morning. Alright. Up here. It doesn't look too bad. It looks almost natural, other than the fact that it's a giant bowl in the ground. Okay, will it go down? Ooh, yes. Okay. Let's see how that looks. Oh, that's cute. That's not too bad. That's not too bad. I think what I'll do is I'll remove this block here. I feel like this block is stunting it a little too much. And let's pick that up and see if it'll... Well, Let's, let's let it clear out, I guess. Hopper, get out of there. You almost drowned before. And are you going to go away? Yep, okay. It's not. Let's get rid of this block, too, I think. Let's try that. Water placement. Water placement for waterfalls. How fun. Isn't that fun? It didn't do it again. All right, that's fine. That's fine. I'll just leave these, then. I might place that like that. Okay. So now they got a little bit of a waterfall, and I think I'm going to change some of this dirt to stone, just to make it look a little more interesting. I got some stone on me. But now, I think what I'll do is, I got rid of my fences, but I think I'll place fences around the top here. So that if they do climb up, they still can't get out, but it still looks somewhat natural. Hmm. Yeah, I think that's what I'll do. I think that's what I'll do. Yeah, let's do that. So this is my plan. 
Um, I've got these stone uh, slabs here, and these are going to go all the way up. Well, not all the way up, but mostly up the tree here. Probably to there will be fine. Let's see if we can't get it even here. Let's see if I look, let me see how many. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight slabs. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I need one more slab here, I think. Yeah, that should be fine. Now, okay, so yeah, that's even. And I'm going to put glass here, and it'll be like a little viewing area for the llamas. And then over here, move Scanlan if you don't mind. Oh, I got to show you the names. I'll show you the names in a second. I have this door that you can get through, so you can go in and see your llamas. But my only problem now, and it's and it's well hidden from the glass area too, so you don't really see it, just like a real zoo. But my problem is now, once I seal this up with glass, the only way in and out will be the door. Do you see my problem? How am I going to get the llamas in and out when I need them? I'm not entirely sure. Hmm. That's a tough one. What do I do? What do I do? What do I do? Do I... Hmm. I don't know. I really don't know. But... Hmm. I don't know how I'm going to get them out, but let me let me show you how what the names are real quick. And if I can't remember who suggested it, I'm sorry. I really am. Um, but uh, I'll go through these ones in a second. Mr. White, I named not only because he's wearing white carpet, but also because he's named after my favorite high school teacher and most influential teacher, Mr. White. Uh, Val, I don't remember who named them, but they named them Val. That's a good name. Spiticus was named F, was named uh, by my girlfriend on a play of Spartacus. Spiticus because they spit. Uh, Jesse goes along with Mr. White, also named by my girlfriend uh, from Breaking Bad. Rosie, I know, is Arabic for pink. I don't remember who named him. I'm sorry. And is that everybody? Is that really everybody? That can't be everybody. Yeah, I guess that's everybody who was named by a subscriber, and then all that's left are the ones that I named myself. Ty uh, Tiberius, Vax, Rog, uh, where are you? Scanlan and Jester were all named after characters from my favorite show called Critical Role. And I'm going to go inside so so I don't die, or they don't die. They're named after my f uh, some of my favorite characters from my favorite uh, show, Critical Role. Scanlan being my favorite character from the show, and recently they started a new season, I guess, or a new campaign. Uh, and Jester is my, new fa is my favorite character so far in the new campaign. And if you don't know what Critical Role is... Um, I highly suggest checking it out. However, if you're if you're not of a certain age, I wouldn't recommend it uh, because it is very uh, adult, I guess. And uh, yeah, um, if you're not of a certain age, don't go watch it. Um, but otherwise, if you are, uh, enjoy yourself. It's a good show. I'll tell you, it's it's a bunch of nerdy voice actors um, who are well known in the industry. Uh, you probably have heard their voices before. You just won't rec you just don't recognize their names. They do a lot of video game stuff, a lot of uh, cartoons, stuff like that. A lot of stuff with uh, Marvel and uh, DC cartoons. And it's a good show. They're playing D&D, &D and it's actually really good. You wouldn't expect it to be, but it is. But those are who the, they are named after. But now, I should have done this while I was inside. Let's get some glass. What was that? Was that a creeper? Hello? That was a really loud creeper blast. Um. Okay. That's three creeper holes in two videos. I'm doing great. 
I did not expect that. Okay. Fun. That was a loud creeper explosion, too. I guess there are some arrows there and some bones. Maybe... Maybe a creeper and a skeleton got into a fight. They got, they had some disagreement. Now, do I have enough glass? To, oh, I definitely have enough glass to do this. All right, so let's go fill this in. And then we will be pretty much done. You know what? I don't want glass either. I don't want glass. I want glass panes. I'm a pinhead. I hope that when the new textures come out for the new update, that it looks better than this. I mean, it looks better than it would otherwise, but I don't know. I don't know about this, man. The streaks kind of just, uh, eh, eh. And quite honestly, I don't know if I prefer the streaks over the borders that the new glass is going to have, but we'll see. But this is pretty much done. One th last thing I want to do is I want to go around here and spam some. There we go. Some bone meal. Make this place look pretty. Pretty like me. Of course I don't look that pretty, but whatever. Come on. Come on. Out of the water. Out of the water. There we go. I think it looks nice overgrown like that, don't you? I think it looks good. Oh, there's a hole here. Can they get through it? They could get out of that, too. Uh, I got more fence repair stuff, and I can get out of that, so they can get out of that. Uh, uh, I'm going to have to go and uh, get some more fences. I, why didn't I think of that ahead of time? Why didn't I think of that ahead of time? All right, let's go ahead and fix that real quick, and then we'll set the llamas loose. I was wanting to leave gaps like that, though, because I think it looks nicer. You know what might be a better idea? If we take... I don't have very many. Let's take some of these. No, you know what? I just saw it in my head, and it doesn't look nicer. I'm just going to grab fences and do it with fences. Not a big deal at all. Go. Go, and I think it's fast becoming night. So I got to hurry. If I have any intent... Oh, I got to put torches down everywhere, too. That's not good. Alright, so I guess let's put one there. See, I wanted this to look nice. By not putting fences every little space. But I guess I can't do that. There we go. There we go. And then they would be able... Okay, let's not lag like that, please. Let's go there. Get out of the water. There we go. Move. Move. Thank you. One there. See, Hopper knows. He's learning. He knows how to. He knows the move when I need him to. Okay, and I guess there. So I guess I can just get rid of you. That's fine. All right. There's a couple more over here. Mm -hmm. Let's just do that. And just do that. Why not? That actually might not look too bad. Let's go see what it looks like from the other side. Eh, that's not too bad. I think that looks all right. And it doesn't look too bad from here either. So let's go ahead and let these guys run free. Let's go through the door, not through the wall. Thank you. Oh, Tiberius. There we go. And there it is. You guys can run free now. Run free. Yeah, look at them. They're enjoying themselves. They're looking at around at their new environment, which I think looks pretty cool. Honestly, I think this is better than my sheep farm, which... I like, but it's starting to get old. I'm going to leave it like that, but it's starting to get old. This is better. This is new. This is fresh. They all got chests. This is great. This is great. All right. Well, this is more... Every time I say this has been a short video, it ends up being 30 minutes long, but I'm pretty sure this is a really short video this time. Um... But yeah, I'm going to leave that video here. Hopefully none of these guys escape. And I recounted. Apparently I actually have 10 llamas. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Yeah, I have 10 llamas over there. Um, yeah. Yeah, I'm going to leave this video here, guys. And again, in the comments, uh, please let me know what you guys would like to see for 100 subscribers. Um, again, I was not expecting to hit this so soon. I'm going to move this. So it's not. It's 
so gross. There we go. And um, we'll see what we can do for 100. Yes, I can't wait. This is going to be great. But uh, I'm going to leave that video here, guys. If you liked it, give that like button a tickle. I would really appreciate it. Uh, subscribe if you're brand new. Leave a comment down below. Ask me anything. Subscribe. Uh, suggest anything. I got that subscribe stuck in my head now. Um, and what else do I usually say? I don't know. Oh, share around with your friends. And if you don't, I don't know why I keep saying this, but believe me, I'll know. Not that I would really know. Who knows? Oh, no. Let's go back and go in with my llamas. Who wants to pose with me? Anybody? Scanlan, do you want to pose with me? No? Hey, don't ignore me. We're both Ender people. Eh, whatever. Anyway, I'll see you guys in the next video. Thank you very much for watching, and I will see you later. Bye!